Welcome back to the Middle East, our final day here, and a third base in three days for us. We can't disclose the location of this one. That's how serious what is going on here, the mission that so many of these men and women have is. But what we can tell you is that we had a chance to spend a lot of time with these servicemen and women, answering questions, hanging out, and another incredibly special afternoon. They are enduring 120 degree heat, and it brings us home. It really does. It was really nice to have them. So it was nice to have them here, of course, bringing a part of home. In the heat, it was nice to sit and listen to their stories about their past and their triumph. But today's my favorite day. Because we actually, I rode in one of those, uh, what's that vehicle called? The big one, F back something, Mac 15 or something. Matt V, got to ride in that. It's a secret mission, but uh, we'll be there uh, in a few hours. Um, you want AM or FM, Joel, on the radio? <laughs> Who do you want to listen to? No AM. The good news is we got Reggie up Reggie, here. Reggie, what up? Reggie. What you doing? The tanks were cool, and so was the military working dog named Dome, who gave us a demo of how he does his job. Hush, dog! Get him! How about Mike Sweeney, perhaps living up to his nickname, Sween Dog? He took a turn. You nervous? No. Wow, you can feel the strength in his jaws. He faced 100 mile an hour pitchers all the time, but how, how many times do you get to fly to the Middle East and have a professional with a superstar dog come and bite you? So I said, what the heck? <laughs> and Mike continued to be adventurous when we found these guys on the side of the road after leaving. Mike, you got bit by a dog, what can you do to top it? Maybe ride a camel, a wild camel. <laughs> I'm going down. <laughs> George, what a week it has been. I know that they're watching this now on the Fox Sports Kansas City Royals live pregame show. How would you sum it up? Uh, I would give it uh, an A+. Plus. It, was, it was an incredible experience and, and seeing how these people ready themselves every day and the preparation they go through to make sure all of us are safe back home. It was unbelievable and I'm so proud to be an American right now. So for George Brett, Reggie Sanders, Brett Saberhagen, Mike Sweeney, uh, for all the folks at the USO, for Ben Aiken, Dina Wathen, Fox Sports Kansas City, and all of our incredible servicemen and women, that's going to do it for us from here. That oh, looks great. Let's go home, boys. Again, good luck tonight to the Royals, and we will see you back at the K soon.